and Brad, the two most famous physical therapists on the internet. Hi folks, I'm Bob Shrub, physical therapist. Brad Heineck, physical therapist. And together we are the most famous physical therapists on the internet. In our opinion, of course, Bob. Today we're going to talk about the easiest ACL test you can do at home. It's for an ACL tear. I, it really is the question, do you have an ACL tear? And we're going to help you answer that. Exactly. Yeah, Bob, this specific test statistically is uh, the easiest uh, and most accurate manual test according to one particular study. And after looking at this uh, and working with it, I, I, it's great. It's, I uh, like it because it's visual. Yeah. It does it rely on your sense of touch. You yeah, know, right, where you need to maybe do yeah. three or 400 tests on a knee to get a good feel for it. So do we have to do some introduction? Well, we'll just we'll mention that we are doing a giveaway. We do one every week. Just go to bobbrad.com, mm. go to the giveaway section, find out what it is. I don't even know what it is this week. You can also find it on Facebook. It'll right. be pinned to the top right. of the page. It could be the big mother load, the cornucopia. That's right. Oh, check out our podcast too. That's right. Really okay. Bob, so let's talk about this. You know, back in the day, the very standard manual tests that therapists, doctors would do, uh, there's three of them that come to my mind that I used to do. The McMurray's, which I, I didn't really like that one. Right. The anterior jaw and the Lachman's. I like both of those. But again, right. it took it took a number, you know. Yeah, you had to do them for a while. Yeah, to get a good, good, good feel for it. Uh, so this one, again. That something... was back when the dinosaurs roamed the earth. <laughs> no, that, yeah. They're still good tests. Yeah, they are. And they're still used. Um, the, the idea is even if you do this test right. and it's positive that you do have a torn ACL, you really cannot confirm that. You need to see a doctor, an orthopedic doctor. They'll do the test and they'll do MRI and you know then you'll confirm. But with this you have an idea of what's going on if they right. do this test with you. Exactly. So it's not new. Uh, so if your knee is still swollen and painful, you're not going to test it. Right. You know, it has to be uh, where you can move it. You may be walking on it, but feels unstable, and you're wondering, is do I have an ACL tear is what we're right. looking at. Uh, so it's quite simple. Typically, you would do this on the floor. Probably a carpeted floor would be best. We're going to do it on the plinth here, uh, but this is soft, and you cannot do it on a bed. So I, I just put this board here. We're doing it up at this level. It's easier viewing for the camera. It's the only reason we're doing it. So we're going to pretend that this knee is fine. Yep. My right knee, my left knee has a tear. Or questionable. A questionable. Right, right, right. So I'll first put the right one up there. Right. Yeah, we can do it this way. So you're going to take, uh, you know, I was going to use this six-inch roll that we use, you know. Sure. Uh, but actually, it's kind of big and awkward. Uh, so I'm going to use this. This is a little over a three-inch piece of PVC right. pipe, actually. You can actually just take a... I suppose a roll towel. Eh, it's got to be firm. It's got to be uh, something right. firm. You know, it just has to be something about you know uh, three and a half to six inches in diameter and I firm. Yeah, bring, bring up. Show because, a little leg, well, Bob. You want well, why not? To see exactly where this is at. You're right. Yeah, you don't want it in the crux of right, the knee. Right. Right. The popliteal facet that will not to be work. anatomically correct. We're gonna go right about there. Um, you could do it with the shoe on or the shoe off. Uh, and what I'm going to do is go above the joint, the joint line, so I'm above the kneecap, take my hand and press right here. Now, and then we're gonna look. Bob is gonna relax. He's gonna be completely that's, relaxed. That's really key here. It is. You have to, yep. and that's why it's partly we wait for the swelling to go down because a lot of times it's too painful before that. Yeah. If it's painful, the person's apprehensive. They're tightening up. Yeah, and you'll get a you won't get an accurate test. Uh, so I'm gonna go here and I'm not gonna jerk on it. It's just a you know pleasant little uh, push down. And then we're gonna look here now. If I press down, see how the, the heel inherently comes off the floor. The reason that's doing it, the, the, the transfer of the force is going right through the ACL ligament, lifting that. Uh, if you have a, a weak ligament then, or a torn ligament. Uh, right, if it's no longer intact. You're gonna like, push down. And the, the heel won't come off. Right, so that's why you do the good leg first, just yes. to get a good feel, because some people have really lax ligaments and it'll vary this test a little bit. So get an idea what the good one looks like. So I know that. Now we're going to do the other one. And 
do this, and do the same thing. And if I push I'll, down, I'll pretend that it's not going up. Yeah, I, I'm it. doing the same force down, and we get no motion at all. Right. And you may even see some translation uh, here at the skin where the yeah, joint is. Yeah, you might see that it's pushing down, yeah. but it's not. Yeah. Yeah, you get more motion there. The person is going to have a different sensation, or maybe a little painful. Uh, so that is the test, and it, it's that simple. Yeah, very simple, very easy to do, and very easy to see. Did Did we mention who started this? No, you did. Ah, uh, it's you uh, give credit. Yeah, the doctor. His name. Uh, he's from uh, Italy. Uh, his name is Dr. I hope I can pronounce it properly, Dr. Alessandro Lilly. It's the Lilly sign or the, the lever sign or the Lilly's test. It's spelled L E L L I. Right, right. So, so you, you can look that up and uh, see what. But the, he, oh, you said he had a lot of. Experience. Oh, he did thousands of ACL surgeries. He's been a, a surgeon for over 30 years. Uh, he's just an expert in the field, and, you know, you just got to depend on. And, and the tests, like I said, really test extremely high in the positivity rate. So, right. it's a Wasn't wonderful a, test. Uh, one study you saw was 100%. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, you know, so we're not just making this up like right. some of our videos. Right. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> we don't make anything up except for about Bob. Being smart. <laughs> yeah. Make that up. All right. All right. Be careful Please. in everything you do.